One of the projects that could receive funding would be the South Monon Trail. It's a path just like this, and it would go from New Albany all the way to Bedford, Indiana. The idea is to create amenities that will attract people in this 21st century competition for workforce. Right now, we have uh, the opportunity to, to build the largest recreational trail in the state of Indiana. The South Monon Trail would utilize this old railroad and connect with the popular Ohio River Greenway. So you have the opportunity to, to do a really special project that should attract people from all over the country and hopefully all over the world to, to see the beauty that we have in Southern Indiana. It's one of 18 projects ready grant funding could impact in Southern Indiana's Clark, Floyd, Jefferson, Scott, and Washington counties. The real key is what are those quality of place amenities that make this a very livable community. At River Ridge Industrial Park, the money could go toward early childhood and workforce development centers. Other projects include a veterinary teaching center at Hanover College and Ivy Tech Madison, a Southern Indiana Youth Sports Complex in Scott County, and improvements to the Salem Municipal Airport. We have so much to offer here. We're not asking for the state's help to reverse negative trends. We're asking them to add accelerant to what the great things that we already have are. Wendy Dantchesser with One Southern Indiana expects to find out by the year's end whether they'll receive the funding. And hopefully by Christmas, we'll get a big present under our tree. Now, if Southern Indiana is awarded this money, it would be just the beginning. They would also have to do private fundraising and get local governments to step up and commit funding as well. Mark Vanderhoff, WLKY News.